Hello all, welcome to session 31 of Selectors Hub training series. In this session, I am going to practically show you how to export XPath locators to Excel file using Selectors Hub. So let's get started. Using Selectors Hub, we can not only export the XPath locators to the Excel file, but also the other type of possible locators for the UI elements can be exported with. Now let me practically show you. For that, first of all, we will launch the Chrome browser where selector sub is already installed. Now let's browse the sample application, say omaya.blogspot.com and right click somewhere on this page and select inspect option. And in the dev tools, select the selector sub functionality. Okay. Now, now select this option guys. Okay. In order to export the locators to the Excel file using selectors hub, now select this record option. Okay. Third option, click to generate automation code for multiple experts. Okay this option guys. just click on this the recording option will be on now right click on any u element for which you want to auto generate the different possible locators here right click on the search button and select inspect option you see different possible locators like x bar cs selectors id class okay tag mm -hmm. name got auto generated for this search button now similarly right click on the text area field text field and uh, select the inspect option again the different possible locators for this text area field also auto generated by the selector sub like that for multiple elements you will do the same right click inspect okay let's say three elements so far now i want to export this uh, all these locators all these possible locators for these different u elements into an excel file okay how to do that for that we have an option here you see we have an option here click to export data into xls okay just click on that you see a csv file is getting downloaded show in folder this is a file open this file you will see that all the possible locators that is X path, CSS selectors, ID, name, class name, link text, partial link text. Okay, all the possible locators for this particular inspected UI elements got auto generated and exported into an Excel file, as you can see here. So, hope guys you understood how to export the different possible locators to the Excel file using selectors hub in this session. So, that's it, guys. See you in the next video session. Thank you. Bye.